Sorry. I have ALS. Last year, I was a healthy 39-year-old. And balancing a career and 10 years of marriage. And this year, I'm battling for my life. This is my family. My youngest, Torn, she thinks she's a princess. And my son, Tanner, he wants to grow up to be a magician. And my oldest daughter, Tilan, she's the artist in the family. My husband, Tim, he, he travels a lot for work, so whenever he gets to come home, we have a little party for him. And uh, my mom, Kay, she has been spending a lot of time with us these days. And my name is Trickett. I've become a stay-at-home mom, and um, not by choice. Last year on a business trip, I was in a city walking around, and I started limping, and I didn't know why. And it didn't go away. After two months of tests and doctor's visits, I was diagnosed with ALS. ALS is a neurological condition that doesn't allow your muscles to take commands from your mind anymore. And eventually, you're not able to move or breathe. This nightmare disease considers everyone fair game. I was literally taking Zumba classes in March and in a wheelchair by July. It's really the love and support I get each day that helps me get up, knowing that today is the strongest I will ever be again. I see things differently now. Special moments happen in slow motion. Sometimes I see them through the future memories of my children. I read a quote that I love that gives me hope. ALS is not incurable, it's underfunded. I can't give the strong, gripping hugs of my earlier days, but I can still give hugs that leave a real piece of me behind. <laughs>